I'm Tommy Harrington, electrical lead for LSU Tiger Racing. So in the past, Tiger Racing's been a senior design project where every single year about a dozen people come together and build a car and then they leave. We've moved it to a club where every single year we have freshmen, sophomores, juniors, all the way up. Uh, they've been on the team for multiple years and they take design and engineering knowledge to the next year to make a better car. It makes for a better club and a better car and a better experience. Our club is fully student-run. Our advisor, Ingmar Schogel, he takes a hands-off approach when it comes to this club. He uh, will suggest things for us to do, but gives us the freedom to design and build the car exactly the way we want it to be. Formula SAE is the Formula Society of Automotive Engineers. It's a competition with a bunch of colleges around the country. We build and design a race car and then make it competition ready for Michigan in May and then you can implement these FEAs into here and you can predict what the damage to My name's Joe, uh, I am a mechanical engineer. As captain, I have to ensure that their systems integrate well within the car and that the entire car works properly as a final product. The process to building a new car starts with last year's car. We need to analyze the data, how we placed and how it performed and how to make it better. It comes from nothing and goes all the way to a drivable car in a matter of three or four months. We'll uh, test it until it breaks, and we'll come back in and fix it. The panel of judges expect us to prove our engineering expertise and how we built our design, our parts, how well our car will grip around a corner, and how aerodynamic the body is, and a bunch of other parameters. Our car is capable of going 100 miles an hour, but in our competition, we only see speeds about 60 or 70 miles an hour. So our car has to corner better than get to its top speed, but acceleration is still an uh, important part of our car. Our first race is held in May at Michigan International Speedway. After all the research and hard work, we hope to place top 25 this year.